Now, the next thing that we have here is a continuation of some news that we covered yesterday involving a company that sold controllers called Swift Grips. And this company was, you know, basically ignoring people, packages weren't getting sent out, and there was a lot of issues going on, and partners were leaving left and right due to all these issues. And they finally put out a statement April 18th at 3.37 p.m. EST, and they put out a public announcement saying this we are aware of the issues and have refunded every order that has not been marked as fulfilled or usps did not complete the delivery if we owe you anything please email swiftcrestmedia at gmail.com we want to thank everyone that helped support us in our journey, but unfortunately, I think it's time due to complications to close up shop. We appreciate everyone that has helped us, and we are sorry we disappointed some. We tried our best to come in and make this something better, but unfortunately, was way too overwhelming as we move forward. Our Twitter will be deleted and website removed on 426. That's pretty quickly. Please do not forget to email us if we owe you anything. Thank you, everyone. Uh, Swift Grip CEO. All right. Yo, King Shield, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the stream, by the way. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. So there we go. And now there's a comment down here. Um, there's a comment down here somewhere uh, that I saw that basically it kind of stated, you know, this is what happens when you, you're, you start too early, too ambitiously, and you sign too many partners to your, to your company, right? Uh, you, you couldn't keep up with product demand. You get very overwhelmed. You scaled too large, too quickly. The business model wasn't scalable, um, or, or wasn't set for, you know, uh, the future essentially. So, um, yeah, so this is kind of inevitable, uh, and it's, it's an interesting response. I mean, it, it kind of makes sense, uh, with all the hate that they've received. I think it'd be really hard for them to honestly continue. So they decided the best course of action here is to shut down the business. So that's exactly what they're doing. Um, and, uh, after all of that stuff that's been going on about them and all their partners leaving them and, uh, lots of bad social media, bad publicity for them. So it makes sense. So they're shutting down everything. Twitter deleted, website removed on 426. Um, and, uh, yeah, there you go. That's your conclusion to the Swift Grip stuff that we talked about yesterday. Uh, this is the first, uh, actual post that they've made. Um, in a little while, actually, since like April 11th, I think it was their first post. So, uh, yeah.